Well, hello out there. Am I live? Can I get a little... Oh, I see myself on the screen. We're good. We're good, baby. Good evening, good morning, good afternoon, everybody watching from all over the world. Welcome to the Sega Crew channel. My name is Naya Ken. I'm life! Thank you, Caesar. Thank you, I'm life! I'm still awake, Dracunus, that's right. I'm here to play some Shinobi. And to uh, put myself on a, a mirror infinite loop. If you look very closely, there are approximately six Nyakans on the screen. But you're going to have to look really, really closely to see the other ones. Guys, we're going to play some Shinobi. Boom. Sega Master System. Can I get an amen in chat? Finally, some Master System. We had some Master System so far. We're going to have some more. We'll be playing a lot more Master System as we go on. So uh, I'm going to have a, another slot uh, at starting at 1 p.m. Eastern Time on Saturday. It's 4 a.m. Eastern right now. We'll be playing ALF. Michael Jackson's Moonwalker. Ken Seiden. Alex Kidd. We'll be, we be, we be playing... All these Master System games. Booster Shane, thank you for organizing this. Thank you for the smooth handoff. Thank you for everything. Thank you for streaming for such a long time. Alf, baby. Alf, baby. We're going to be speedrunning it. And by speedrunning, I mean holding forward and jumping a lot. Kind of like how I ran my Castle of Illusion race. <clears throat> That's right. I'm the guy that won that race. No, not really. It's not true. I didn't even come close. Guys, we're playing Shinobi. We're playing Shinobi for Sega Master System. Always go right, baby. That's what we gotta do. I, yeah, I know. It's like a six-minute speedrun. I'm gonna be speedrunning it in like, you know, uh, three hours. No, no, I won't be that bad. I grew up with Sega Master System. I've got a lot of love for this console. I think it doesn't get enough love on Twitch, so I'm glad that you're all here to show it some love with me. <coughs> I'm going to show you a really good game, Shinobi. It came out in 1988. 1988. About two years into the SMS run. About two years in. So, uh, uh, I like to always start out, whenever I'm playing one of these games, with the manual. Because uh, I was the kind of kid that actually read the manual. And the reason why I read the manual, and the reason why you would read an SMS manual, is because the manual would give you hints and tips. And sometimes the manual would lie. They would deliberately lie to you. To screw you up. And this is actually my first time playing Shinobi. I mean, I know this game very well. And I'm here to show this game to you. Let's go through the manual real quick. This is my favorite part. When you would open up that hard plastic case, that factory smell. You've got that clunky rectangular cartridge in there and this beautiful grid uh themed manual inside this was this this was this was a delight i would savor this before i would part that before i would pop that cartridge in let's go through it i can't wait shinobi you are a master ninja standing against you are the meanest group of terrorists ever to take up guns and martial arts weapons but you have a secret weapon Ninja magic. This is going to be good. Oh, this page intentionally left blank. All right, we don't need this. I know how to push the power button. Shinobi. The name means stealth. It's one of the qualities you have, learned in a lifetime of training, in a discipline passed on in your family from father to son over the decades. Ninjutsu. You are Joe. Joe. <laughs> Our name's J- <laughs> Our name's Joe. Your name is Billy. You are Joe Musashi. Oh, Musashi, that makes up for it. The Master Ninja. Your hands and feet are lethal. With shuriken, sword, nunchaku, <laughs> nunchucks, and other weapons... You are virtually unstoppable. You're also a deep cover agent for the government. What the hell? Called on when the fate of the nations is at stake. Wait, this is the real Shinobi story? This is ridiculous. I love this game. This time you must battle the Ring of Five. 
a terrorist network led by five evil ninjas with powers as strong as your own. The Ring of Five has kidnapped the children of the world's leaders, all of them, and are holding them hostage in different locations around the world. And some of them are probably jerks. Well, each is guarded by karate thugs, deadly mercenaries, and the meanest martial artists in the world. You have five missions. In each, you must rescue the hostages, take out the Ring of Five's henchmen, and defeat a leader of the Ring of Five. They have might on their side. But prove your skill with the shuriken, and you will earn ninja magic to aid you. Good luck. This will be your toughest assignment ever. Hmm. You have two buttons. One and two. Good. All right, one is attack, two is jump. Got it. Ba -ba -ba. Little, little artist renderings of the bosses. I always loved this because they would look good here, and then they would look nothing like the drawings in the game. That was always good. Look at this. this guy's name is Lobster. <laughs> His parents hated him. Look at this guy. What a nerd. Lobster, you're a nerd. Alright, here's the important part. You begin with Shinobi with three lives. You die. And then you, and then you lose. For every 100,000 points you score, you receive an extra life. This is very important to know. So we shouldn't just run through it. We should get some points. Get some extra lives, you know? Oh, cool, we've got this part where it's like, you know, a bonus round. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, if you make it through the bonus round, you receive 500 points for every ninja you hit, and you, you, you earn the use of ninja magic. That's important. Ninja magic. Top center. Got it. Ninja magic gives you many powers. To use it, you must take out 10 enemies in the following round. When the leftmost tile starts flashing... You may use ninja magic. You may have up to four ninja magic tiles in the order they were obtained, but you may hold no more than four. There are six different types. Metal binding magic. Freezes the movements of all enemies on the screen. Invincible magic. You'll be invincible. Eight hands magic. Using this magic will release eight other selves from you. Oh, that's freaking cool. Eight sprites? What? What? That's got to be some blast processing right there. Flying squirrel magic. That's pretty cool. You can fly. Lightning, tornado, got it. Ba -ba -ba. Power ups. Uh huh. Weapons. Okay. All right. Throwing a knife, bombs, pistol. Yeah, okay. Underlings. Some more artist renderings. This stuff was so cool, man. Here we go. Here are the helpful hints. Sometimes they're really good, sometimes they're not great, and then sometimes they flat out lie to you to deceive you. And, and I, I've never understood why, but sometimes they really lie to you. Like an afterburner. The enemies, especially the leaders of the Ring of Five, attack in patterns. Learn the patterns and... Okay, blah, blah, blah. Each enemy leader is a weak spot, blah, blah, blah. Try extra hard to make it through the bonus rounds, blah, blah, blah. Gain the long-range weapons will make it easier to beat many of the enemies. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Okay, these weren't so good. These tips weren't so good. But that's okay. Guys, let's get in the game, huh? Let's get in the game! Let's finally do this! Guys, let's do this. Let's play the game, huh? It is time to play the game. It starts off without music, which is kind of weird. But then the music start, starts. <laughs> oh, file number 4162, Ken O. And then some scribble. Oh, here we go, baby. Here we go, baby. Oh, it's time. Let's go, Joe Mushash, Musashi. Yo, Joey. Yo, this is how Joey jumps. What a nerd. He jumps with, like, both feet at the same time, like a kangaroo. It's kind of weird, right? Oh, ooh, I got him. Oh, that's a kid. This is just like Moonwalker. Michael! Oh! Ooh. Oh, I'm a ninja, baby. Boom, got him. I got that kid. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh. Oh, I didn't kill him. Wait, how do I... Whoa! Why did I do that? Whoa! Right, I got that kid. That's cool. <laughs> this is freaking cool, man. I love this game. This game is amazing. 
Here, I want this kid to- Oh, shit! Woohoo! Got him. I want that kid too. Got him. Oh. Oh. Got him. Stealing all these kids. Collecting children. I hope Booster. I hope the monkey will point the way to the bosses, because I'm already getting lost in this level. There's multiple levels. Oh no. He was shooting low. I couldn't I couldn't just do that, I think. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, look at that. the child I did it too got him bonus stage wait what does that mean I get to go to the bonus stage cool oh shit surprise bitch <laughs> oh it's Joe Musashi acting like you didn't know acting like you didn't know oh I died I'm good at this game yeah, this is this is like an arcade port. So the Master System um, ported a lot of arcade games, and they were usually pretty faithful. Um, in some instances, they were arguably, well, I don't know better about the better than the arcade, but some of their ports were like really great versions of the game, like Choplifter. Choplifter was a really good port. Oh no. There we go. Oh, rip. Rip, 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 rip. Oh, I want that child. Thank you. Hello? Hello? Surprise! Man, this game is so good. Oh, is this a boss? No. I did it. The music changed. I beat the level. Mm -mm. Oh, sweet. Yes. Oh, what the? F oh, what? Oh, there we go. Okay. What? Oh! Oh! I did not do so good in that bonus. That was weird. <laughs> I failed. No! Booster, I failed. Keno's still coming after me. Or I'm going after Keno. Yeah, that's it. Marilyn Monroe. Oh, got him. Got him. Hmm. Yo, check out Spider-Man up here. See this guy in the top right? Got him. Uh oh! Oh, ha, ha, ha. I have the child. Interesting. It's funny because the child flies away just like in Moonwalker. I wonder if Moonwalker... I don't know, was inspired by Shinobi. Probably was. Probably took from like, like the good games of, of the time, right? And used what worked at the time. Why not, right? Because the way that kid just flies off like that, that's exactly like what it looks like in uh... Or am I remembering that wrong? Maybe I'm remembering it wrong. Ken O. Oh, what? Whoa, this guy's huge, yo! Oh no, probably his face. I did not do any research. No. 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 
No. Huh. I think it sounds like, uh, like I'm not hitting his weak spot. Unless I'm supposed to just, oh my god. Unless I'm supposed to just... Ooh. No, that's definitely not it. That ain't it, Chief. That ain't it. I was thinking like his head, his face. Something like that. Let's see. Part of the fun for me with this, uh, and by the way, I'm, I'm running a Sega Master System challenge on my channel, where I'm playing all of the uh, North American released Sega Master System games. Part of the fun for me with these games is just exploring them. Like, I, I, I don't like to do a lot of, um, a lot of research ahead of time, besides just kind of, you know, if there's like interesting facts about like, the production of the game, I like to, I like to know those. Um, because I think the true experience of this is, is like that, that experience of, you know, exploring, uh, discovering all of the little, all of the little things about the game. <coughs> Just all the little things. I don't know how to explain it beyond that. Like, <clears throat> like knowing how to jump off of boxes or, or like learning your timing. I think that process is interesting to see, too. Shadow Dancer saves women. Interesting. Oh, man. Oh, I got one. Oh, no. They got me. I got one that time, at least. I failed. I failed again. Kenno, I'm coming for you, Kenno. Kenno, I'm coming for you. Oh, no. I don't get any ninja magic, you guys. It's okay, I'm gonna earn my way into getting that ninja magic. That's part of the, that's part of the fun, really. That's part of the journey. Like, achieving... That was the thing about the Sega Master System, man. It did not give... And, and arcades, too, right? They didn't just give you things. You had to earn him. That's why you have to like get through a bonus stage to like even be able to like use magic, and you have to like hit it perfectly, probably. Like you gotta get good before this game rewards you for anything. And that's the Sega Master System way, man. That's how that's how consoles were in the eighties. Like, if, if you want to beat a game, you have to beat it. You have to beat the game. You have to be better than the game. None of this Nintendo crap, where it's just like... Whoops. Like, oh, let me just run through this game, and if I make it to the end, then I win. No, man, you gotta defeat the game. Oh, that, that's, that made a sound. Okay. There we go. I gotta hit that pixel in there. Oh god. Yeah! Got him! Got him! Got you, Ken O! Rip Ken O. Can I get some Fs in chat for Ken O? Oh, Ken O got the stamp. Boom! Deceased. That's his morgue papers. Oh, time, time for us to fight a helicopter. <laughs> Black turtle rip. Oh! Ooh, these guys are fast! Guys, please, one at a time. Told you, no autographs. No autographs. No Joe Musashi autographs. Sorry. Sorry, guys. Hmm, interesting. Let's see what happens here. Yep, I knew I was gonna get dinged on that one. What? Oh, this is weird. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> so, 
it, it, it treats these different areas as different planes. So you can't just like shoot the guy even though you see him. You have to move to the to the other plane. I have to jump down to the second dimension of this game before I can engage this guy. Like this. Oh, I got bombs? What? I got bombs? I got grenades? Shoo. I got grenades, dude. Oh, yeah. I got grenades! Oh, these grenades suck. But <laughs> why did I ever get How did I even get these? I don't want grenades. I like my ninja stars, dude. Alright, Joe Musashi, let's show him how it's done. Oh god. Oh, get away from me. Oh, got him. Yeah. Got my nunchaku. Oh, shoot. Ooh. Ooh. Took a grenade to the face, boy. Ooh. -hoo. Show him how it's done, Joey. Boom. Oh, look at that butt shot, man. Check that out. He, like, turns for the camera. I like that. How, how do you even... Oh, there we go. Oh, no, not that one. That one got through. Oh, it's a blue ninja. Oh, no, he got me. He got me. From it, it feels like the worst game. Or, the, not the worst game. The worst weapon in the game. Those grenades are horrible. It's like a trap when you get that, right? It's like... This, that's, how, that's how this console is. That's how these games are, man. They'll screw you up if you're not paying attention. Not all weapons are good. Not all things are good. Oh, I blew up... Okay, good. I didn't blow up the kid. Michael! Let's see if I can pull this off. Oh, you can't uh, change planes on this one. Yes, you can. I lied. Boom. Boom. Alright, where's my monkey? Monkey, where do I go? Ooh, nunchucks to the face. Oh, I like how we have a oh, little audio glitch there. That boomerang sound just keeps going. That's kind of funny. I hope it... I hope it clears at the next scene. Otherwise, this is gonna be a really annoying run. Ooh, got him. Oh, there we go. It cleared when he threw it again. Nice. Boom, eat it. Eat that grenade. Eat it. Oh, no! Oh, I'm dead -o. Mm. There's one mechanical boss and one copyright infringement boss. Excellent. Well, this might be like the choplifter boss of this one. I feel like this was just a... I don't know. I see a helicopter, I think Choplifter. Especially, you know, like 1988 arcades. I don't know. I think Choplifter. Oh man. Oh man! These guys are getting me. At least we hit 100,000 points, I got an extra life. That's cool. Oh, I've got my ninja stars back. Hell yeah, dude. These are way better. I think the secret message here was, you know, like... Oh no, ancient Japanese weapons better than modern... Boom Boom weapons. Oh baby! Thank you for that follow! Welcome to the Sega crew! How do I get up here? Ugh. I want to change planes, please. Oh, it's not letting me. There we go. Okay, that was kind of weird. Just, just, let's take a moment to appreciate Joe Musashi's butt when I do this. Oh, baby, look at this. Joey, tell me more. Joey. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, the squat. Oh, no, Joey. Oh, baby, Joey, one more time? Are we doing this? Let's go, baby. Oh! The squat butt lift. Defying gravity. Joe Musashi. Joey M. Oh. Known on the streets as Joey Moo. Straight out of East LA. Not true. I gotta kill this guy or something or what? I don't know. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Oh, there's more to this. Okay. That makes more sense. Michael. Oh, shit. No. Z-Tox, what's up? Oh, no. Oh, I got Boomerang, dude. J-Mash. J-Mash is, is a street name. Joey Moo, a.k.a. J-Mash. Mash that one button, J-Mash. Oh, man. Those guys are, like, harder. I don't know. I'm taking, like, multiple hits. Do -do 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 -do. This guy keeps getting me because he spawns after you jump. But I think in the future I gotta do like something like that. Like jump in to spawn him and, and then away. Hopefully I, I'm not running that. <laughs> hopefully I don't deal. Hopefully I don't deal with this guy again. Because if I deal with him again, that means I died again, but. Uh. Yes. Die boomerang guy. Right, I'm not dealing with this green guy. Going straight to the next level. Oh! Oh! Fucking hell. Oh my god. No! That's not how I wanted this to go! Game over. Shit no be! Alright, Keno, I'm coming for you again, dude. Coming for that ass. Mm, yeah, I could do this. I believe in myself. I believe in Joey Moo. I believe in J-Mash. J-Mash. J-Mash got this. J-Mash got this. Oh! You were fast, but I was faster. Trying some Castle of Illusion jump strats here. Oh, took a sword to the to the heel. Got him in his Achilles heel. What do you think that guy's name is? I think his name is Thug, according to the manual. Got him. My heel. <clears throat> oh, got that guy in the elbow now. My elbow! My kneecap! Joey Moo don't care. Look at that booty. Mmm. 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 Okay, it looks like jumping doesn't make me go faster in this game. Actually, there's like a stutter sometimes when I jump. It might even make me slightly slower. Cyber Shinobi. I only know that it wasn't a, um... Oh no, they got me. I only know that it wasn't a North American release for Sega Master System. So I'm not sure if it might have come out like in Europe, say, or Japan. Whoa! Whoa!
Got him. These guys aren't really, like, really good at hiding on the wall. Oh, That was some BS timing. Oh, I'm starting to feel like a pro at Shinobi, man. I've got the timing, I got the flow. I'm jumping into boomerangs. I got this on lock. Goodbye, Spider-Man. Got all the kids. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -bum -bum. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Oh! Oh, well, that was a weird hitbox. That was a weird hitbox! What are you doing to me, Kenno? Just going through- just fighting through that damage. Fighting through that damage. <clears throat> it was released in Canada. Huh. Ken O. Deceased. That's interesting. That's a rare case of something being released in Canada but not the U.S. Oh. Oh, man. It's four in the morning, after all. Oh, shoot. Jo Joey, uh, Joey Moo forgot that when they go low, we go high. And when they go high, we go low, baby! Joey Moo! It's like the Home Alone house. Joey Moo! Oh no! How did I get grenades? No! I didn't want this! When did I pick these up? Do not want! Ow! Do not want! Do not want! YOLO. Sometimes you just gotta believe in the RNG. And by RNG, I mean the pattern. That's right there in front of you. Got him. Hey, Joey! With the butt shot. <clears throat> oh man, I'm, I'm doing good. Oh, Blue Ninja got me. No, Green Ninja got me. No. You failed. One of these days, man, I'm not gonna fail, all right? And then... The joke's gonna be on you. Shinobi. Joey Moo in the house. Can I blow myself up with those? Joey Moo! Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Eat that. Ooh, I like this. I'm just gonna crawl around. Look at that. Look how sneaky Joey Moo is. Look how sneaky. Look. He's got eyes on the back of his head. Look. Can't mess with Joey Moo. Joey Moo's too strong for you. Ah, Joey Moo. Go away. Go away. This is the ultimate strat. This is peak performance. You may not like it. But this is what peak, peak, peak Joey Moo performance looks like. Joey Moo jumping down, cause he can! Oh shit! Cause he can, folks! Joey Moo! Eat that. 
Eat that. Nah, <laughs> got him. Michael! Life max, baby! Let's go! Eat that. Okay, grenades are actually useful on this level. Oh. Pfft. Got boomeranged. Got boomeranged. Oh, now I'm back. Wait, these don't look like ninja stars. These are like. These have bullets, look. Oh man, I've got a gun? I've got a gun, you guys. Joey Moo, jump up there. No? You don't want a Joey Moo? Okay. I don't want to go out. Oh no, I didn't want to go out. There was another kid I had to steal. I got an Uzi. You couldn't bring the Uzi to the bonus round? What's going on? Do you want to win the bonus round, Joey Moo, or not? Bring the Uzi. Oh no. No, Joey. They got you, man. You failed, Joey Moo. I can almost read the script now. It's, it says, Rehubert. Oh, damn it. All right, back to Home Alone. Ooh, sword to the scuba gut. Eat that. Eat that. Oh, they got swords too. All right. Got him. Ooh, headshot. Third shot. Shoot you in your toesies. <laughs> uh, get wrecked. Whoa. Wish I had some ninja magic. Oh shit. Scuba. Scuba. Stranger danger. Oh my god. Invincible Scuba Man. No, not not 1337. 1988. We didn't have the word leet in the 80s. We were we were rad. We were rad hackers. We were cool dudes. And excellent bros. Oh god. And we hung out with bodacious ladies. And awesome babes. We were also tubular, that's that's true. Oh. Oh. Oh shit. No, get out. Joey Moo, no. More stranger danger. Where's the guy shooting the toesies? Does he come later? Ooh! God damn it. Oh my god. Joey, move! Come on! You're embarrassing me, Joey! Alright, good. Get out of here, Joey. Joey, move! Reinhardt Rewayward Latini scribble as Lauer. Hmm. Very hard to make out. Oh shit, it's Choplifter. Alright, that ain't his weak spot. Shit. Oh, that ain't his weak spot. Oh, motherfucker. Oh no, bitch. Man, where's his weak spot? Is this one of those things where you gotta break it apart with uh, melee? That could be it. Maybe the window? Oh, the frames. They're slowing down. Woo! Whoa, hello. All right, chill out, man. Oh my god. Oh, these guys are sick, man. These guys don't play around. Joey Moo. Joey. All right, this ain't it. What about this? Nah. 
I think it's this window. Oh my god, the missiles. I think it's that window. I think you have to kill one of those ninjas that jump out, and then the and the helicopter gets low, and that's when you hit the window. Try the missile launcher. Oh, okay. I tried hitting it, but um, I must have been hitting the wrong spot. I must have been just hitting the wrong spot. Because my, my eyes were moving like all over the place. Okay, so missile launcher makes more sense. It was yellow. Okay, I'll try that next time. Ugh. Ugh. Got him. Oh, oh, okay, rip. Oh no. So I'm using like a real SMS controller. And you know, it's like 30 years old, so. When the when the wire gets a little loose, like the inputs go away. So I had to like jiggle my controller a little bit until it started working again. Give it a little CPR. We're good now though. Yeah, that's it for kids. Yeah. Oh the standard D pad. Got the got the good old boy right here. Oh, Oop, as he drops inputs, because I moved it. <laughs> Got the good old boy. Eat it. Eat it. Easy. Joey, move! Got him. Got your kid. Got your kid. Uh oh. This controller was mad that I twisted it. My controller got camera shy. Joey Moo. Hello? Oh, no. No controller. That was the worst time. That was the worst time, controller, to not take my inputs. No. Controller, bad timing. And you need to you need to move when I tell you to move. Please. Please, you need to not do nothing. I'm adding my own track to this game. Music is good in this game, man. I like it. The PSG chip for the SMS, I think, is underappreciated by 16 bit boys. And that's okay. They like their little FM chip. They think everything sounds better in FM. But they f they just don't realize how good the PSG chip sounds when it's coming through a TV. It is so good. Got him. Oh! Oh! no! Oh, Green Ninja got me. Green Ninja! I would say that if, if there were like maybe 10 or 11 consoles that we would consider like retro consoles booster, then this would be the top like 10 or 11 sound chips of, uh, <laughs> of the retro consoles. Which is to say, this is a very good chip. <laughs> uh, got him. So this sound chip had three channels. And believe it or not, all of these sound effects 
were um, were part of a wave sound effect. So this gunshot is just a, a an extremely shortened um, part of a wave sound effect, like an ocean wave sound effect. In fact, all of the percussion you'll hear is just a piece of that wave. And so you'll hear the, you'll hear the full wave in Outrun for SMS. That wave that's like in the radio is what's what naturally exists in the third channel of this sound chip. They just let the third channel play. It's really cool. Like that's that's what you get in the third channel. And then when you slice and dice that up and change the frequencies and play with it, you just make percussion instruments out of it or sound effects. They're all these are all just coming from the sound of waves crashing on the on a beach. So that's a cool little fact about this sound ship. It had two music channels. And uh, like a sound effect channel. And that was it, man. So out of those three channels, you get everything. Music and sound effects. Hi, Spider-Man. Hello, little girl. I yeah, know I'm coming for you, baby. Oh. Oh. Keno, yeah, take it to the face, baby! Eat it! Eat it, Keno! Oh, whatever. Oh no. There we go. One more. Got him. Yeah! Joey O. No, Joey M. Joey Moo! Killing Ken O. A little deceased stamp on his face. Alright, time to get Black Turtle. It's Shinobi versus Choplifter. Kids, tell your parents today to buy you Shinobi. And not Choplifter. Boo, Choplifter. Actually, Choplifter is <laughs> an excellent. Excellent SNS game. It's an excellent game. Even though it's made in like the old school arcade style, which is like the um, the game never ends, it's about getting a high score style. So even though there's like really like so they created an artificial ending to Choplifter, and it's when you beat the sixth level, they give you like credits, but then it just keeps going on forever. So they did that so that they could, you know, say they gave the kids at home an ending, but the truth is that Shoplifter never ends. It never dies, it never leaves our hearts. Or our arteries. Joey Boo! Let's go, Joey. Joey, we got more butt lifts to do today, let's go. Let's go, Joey, up and at him. Up and at him, Joey. Does this kid give me grenades or something? How does this work? No, no grenades. I don't know where I got these grenades from. Maybe it's a score thing. Could be a score thing. I don't think there are any kids over here, so I'm just gonna skip that. Boom, got him. Got him. Whoa! Got him. Oh, Joey! Joey with the deeks! Joey with the triple D, baby. Hmm. Hmm. Joey, make that pyramid with your legs. Do it. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. Flash those frames. Flash those frames, Joey. All right, I'm gonna win one of these freaking bonus rounds. I'm telling you. I'm gonna do it. Ooh, baby. Oh, I missed the blue guy. Yes! Show no controller! Son of a bitch! Oh I had it! I had it! Oh I had it! <sighs> I 
I failed. I failed. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go through this like intestine looking cave. I like what you've done with the place trap lifter. Oh shit. Go Joey, go. Oh look look at look at the look at the life bar on the top. Look at that. <laughs> look how their sprites are in front of the life bar. That's so cool. Now that has to do with how um the master system would actually put Oh, I, I, re I remember learning why this was the case. Most Master System games would perform this way. It was a way that they were using the memory, or making the most of it or something. So like the the info on the top, I don't know. Oh god, I gotta look that up. I forget why it was, but a lot of games did that, or would have done that, if like you put a sprite in front of it. Like that, that overlay on the top was actually behind the game. And that's why they would separate it like that. That's why you'll notice, like, a lot of this stuff on these games, there's, like, a clear partition between the overlay and the game itself. The over, like, the info isn't in the game. Like, you don't have, like, a little icon of your life in the bottom right corner, like you would in Genesis. It's separate from the game itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's probably it. Like, it's it's like the refresh rates and all that, all that crazy techno babble that I don't understand. Run, Joey! Oh, God. Got him. Got him. So green ninja strata, shoot him in the nuts. Got it. Shoot him in the nuts. Easy. Shoot him in the toesies. Got him. Oh no. Oh yes. I hope that neck crack came through on stream. God, it felt good. Joey, we gotta go get this child over here. Shoot him in the nuts, Joey. Get him. Joey Moo. I got Nunchaku now. I saw that flash up. <laughs> I got I got Nunchaku. That was the Achilles heel of the 80s, Caesar. Goddamn overlays on top. Oh no, they got me. Oh, no, they don't. Oh, I'm alive, baby. Oh, shit, now I'm dead. Fuck me. Oh. Oh, no. Failed. I'm sick of seeing that. I'm gonna get you one of these days, game. Dun -dun 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 -dun. We're getting close to the end of our time, guys, so I just want to say thank you for hanging out. Hope you enjoy enjoyed seeing me, um, you know, I, I know there are probably some guys out there that know the game very well. And I hope that it was enjoyable to see somebody, like, learn the game for the first time. Uh, you might remember, or not, because it might have been a long time ago when you played this as a kid, but you might remember what it was like learning the game and the timing and the challenges that you went through. And I hope that, um seeing me uh, kind of learn the game as I go through was uh, was interesting to you as well. I, I prefer interesting gameplay, and I hope you found this interesting. Uh, my name's Nikan, Booster again. Uh, thanks for organizing, and Booster's up next. He's going to be playing some, uh, whatchamacallit, what's on the schedule? He's going to be doing some Sega Arcade games. Oh man, Alien Syndrome? What? I didn't know that. So it's an SMS game. Unless that, unless that came out for something else. Alien Syndrome is a great SMS game. I grew up with that one. Riot City and Ninja Princess. So Booster Shane's coming on next. Let me just uh, see if I can die real quick and then... Uh, 
I'll get on. I'll uh, un undeafen myself in in uh, the old Discord here for a little handoff. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm actually going to play this to completion uh, in my channel as part of my challenge. So I'm going to play this and every other um, SMS game released in North America. I think there's 114 or 117. I forget the exact number. But yeah, we're going to be playing them all. Um, so if you just check out the channel, um, I stream like a few times a week. It's a little tough with my work schedule, but I'm usually on um, evenings. I live in the East Coast US, so for me it's evenings on the weekdays, and then on the weekends I'll start in the morning, so it's a little bit more European friendly. So I'll usually start like 10, 11 in the morning on Saturday or Sunday. And so you can always um, you can always catch me um, on the weekend if if catching me like late at night and in uh, Europe is a little too tough. Oh boy. I, don't, I didn't hear... I didn't hear the audio cue that I did it right. Hmm. Hmm. You want to see that? Oh, rip, I got game over it anyway. So that's 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 perfect timing, actually. Um, yeah, and actually we've... Um, it's pretty early, so... I um I started out my challenge with emulation, and I got about 25 games completed that way, and then I restarted because um I got my real hardware set up, and so I wanted to start over and, and say that I beat every game on the original hardware, just I don't know, just to say I really beat the real games. So we're actually starting over. So the only games I've beaten so far in the challenge, officially, are Alf and Alex Kidd in High Tech World. Both of which I'll be featuring uh, later in about, what is it, six, seven, eight hours um, at the 1 p.m. Eastern slot. Along with uh, Michael Jackson's Moonwalker and Ken Sidon. So we've got a whole bunch of SMS games coming up. And uh, I think I'm going to unmute myself here in Discord, so I, so I, or undeafen myself. Oh yes, here we go. Oh yeah. Oh, Booster's ready. Oh, yes, Booster's was... Booster is born ready. Great job! I, you know, uh, this is such a difficult game, and I can't believe this was blind. Yeah, yeah I'm very I, impressed. I, uh, I am used to just getting punished by this console <laughs> and arcade games from the '80s. So, um, I, you know, I, I have survived Choplifter and Afterburner. Although I do need to go back and beat that. And so Shinobi is sort of like um, a nice vacation from games that just want to see you <laughs> die a, a miserable death, like in real life. <laughs> I love it. Absolutely. So Booster, I'm going to hand this over to you. I'm just going to kill this thing. Um, okay. Uh, thanks again, and uh, good luck in your runs. Thank you. Awesome. Hey. All right, so I'm going to kill this. Uh, bye, everybody. Thanks again for watching.